New Age Tactical. Hold on. <laughs> All right, guys. New Age Tactical back with another video. Uh, flashlight. Flashlight. So, this one's made a cameo before. <laughs> uh, this was a Christmas gift. Christmas gift. Damn, it's in the middle of February, but we're finally getting to it. Uh, a lot of delays. This is the Through Night T1, I'm yes, assuming. I think okay. that was the name, T1. I like the box. Ooh. I like the box a lot. Gives you these quick little instructions that are in four different languages, but it just says to screw down the light head and tail cap tightly before use. It's just something about a good package that makes me really like a flashlight, or I mean, or anything really. But gradual. Oh, easy. Look, look. And this is boasting 1,500 lumens. This is what this is claiming. I don't know. Are they, like, super reputable? I've heard the name before. I have two. I'm not 100% on them. By the way, this was $40. 40 dollars So a little on the expensive side. Yeah, but for 1,500. Turbo mode is 1,500 lumens down to 408 lumens. So it'll run on turbo or 1,500 for three minutes. Then on 408 lumens for 52 minutes. Infinity high is 685 lumens, which will run for 65 minutes. Infinity low is 15 lumens for 35 stunden? What the f Did this just change languages? What is 35 stunden? What, you don't know your stundens? No, but hold on then. Then it goes, Firefly is 0.5 lumens for 12 tog. <laughs> <laughs> what the f means hours in German. Okay. So, 15 lumens for 35 hours. What is a tog? Days. Ah. All right. So, Firefly is moonlight. Yeah. For 12 tog, which is 12 days. And then it goes back to fucking English. What is this? <laughs> 550 lumens. The strobe is 550 lumens for 120 minutes. Instructions a little weird, guys. Not gonna lie. Many thanks for your purchase from Through Night. Many thanks. Many thanks. Uh, you got your little lanyard. Okay, that's typical. Ooh, pocket clip. I don't use the pocket clip, so I'm not even gonna put it on. It's kind of stupid to put it on, but it's a little heavier than you think it'd be too. And it is. It's um. What one is that? Micro USB. The flat bottom. Yes. Quick downfalls. Pricing wise, it's a little high priced. Not the magnetic tail cap or anything. I mean, or I'm sorry, not the magnetic. Where's the charging port? It is magnetic tail cap. Oh. The charging port is here. So it's and you said IPX8 though. Yeah, four meters. All right, so that's a pretty damn good uh, charging cover. It's rougher it's a to lot plug. It, it's rougher to plug it in, and it's a little bit more money than. I don't know. But this is sporting 1,500 lumens, which is the same as that Skybend Warrior for like a third of the size. No, half. We'll say half. Uh, I'm dumb as shit. I was reading the German instructions. <laughs> so I guess minutes in German are the same in, in English. Because you get to like halfway through and in German and English are the same. But then, all right. Lock under lockout mode. Press and hold the side switch for three seconds to unlock the flashlight. When flashlight is off, press and hold the side switch for one second to enter firefly mode. Under firefly mode, press and hold the side switch for three seconds to access lockout mode. Change modes. With the light on, long press the switch to circle through infinity. I'm, I'm assuming they mean cycle. Through infinity high and infinity low. Press and hold the side switch for one second to get firefly mode. Double click to turn to turbo from any mode. Triple click to get strobe. All right, so I like it. So it's gradual, which we just seen will show on camera better. But you're starting off at uh, 
15 lumens and slowly working up to 685 lumens and you can stop it anywhere in between and it'll memorize where you stopped it so it's a little heavier than you think right were you messing with me no are you not messing with me no it's it's a little Dude, this this thing is super light it's 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 not though for that size two and a quarter ounces yeah, dude, this feels like nothing. I don't know. It kind of feels heavier to me. That is really cool. Though. Yeah, that's a cool set. Uh, uh, <laughs> definitely cool. The, like, because you stop and press and hold again, and it goes the opposite direction. So wherever you stopped, now you press and hold again, it starts going back up again. Well, yeah, that's I, pretty cool. I'll be honest, the only thing that's bothering me is the price point. I don't know why it's bothering me so much. What did you pay for the Skybend? You paid 65 But that's 65 for a full-size, or, I mean... Not full size, but this is a big f- man. Like this, this is EDC. This is this is not full size. This is going toe to toe with a full size light, though. But size wise, of like a baton, a little bigger than a baton. It's a little bit thicker than a baton, but it's no, boast- it's a little taller. Than that's a baton. boasting weight. It's thicker too. No, I, I'm saying that's why it's fatter. Is it? You think? Definitely. I don't think so. Not from a baton. Definitely. I've used the baton every night. That's a little bit fatter. Just a tiny bit. Yeah, a little tiny bit, yeah. I, I mean, even the 500 lumen one is now $30. This is $10 more than the 500 lumen Olight. You know what I mean? I'm kind of being like an Olight fanboy in a way. I think so. And, like, quality-wise, though, compared to an Olight, it has the same feel, the same quality. It doesn't feel cheap. It doesn't feel like... Oh, this is definitely not an old light type type light. If you took the labeling off this and handed it to someone that didn't know flashlights very well, they'd probably think this was an old light. I don't know why it keeps it keep popping into my head. Yeah, it's weird that's really reasonable. So, you press and hold. Holy sh! Whoa, whoa, whoa! And that's six eighty five. I didn't know where to stop to get down to that point five, but look. So when it does that, fuck, now I, now I need to drop it in order to see it. So this is middle of the road. It does the blink and then tells and you you're on. And then that's in the Firefly. So that's pretty light. cool because I was like, damn, how do so I know So the same it goes the opposite for turbo. Yeah. It does a blink before turbo. No, no. This is not turbo. This is just 685. It's still not turbo. No. Jesus. That's turbo. All right, so... 5.6 again. That's 685. Turbo. Damn. Moonlight. 0.5. So, right now I can see the umbrella that's only about 6 feet so, away from us. We're going to just go slow. Six eighty five. Damn. You can e- easily see everything. Easy. So then go to turbo. Yeah. Still on 2.8. See, it's funny. Turbo just kind of fills in a couple of gaps. Yeah. All right, hang on. We might have f***ed up. So, All right, so 0. 0.5. Yeah, this is... You can't see Run of the mill, same thing we've seen before. Yeah, Emmy, look down at the ground. Oh, it's not going to pick that up. No, okay. Yeah, no. So then, basically what this is saying is... In Firefly mode, it's 0. 0.5. Intensity low is 15 lumens. That's so what we were working We were looking before. at 15 lumens, so not 0. 0.5. So 15 lumens is very doable. That's 15 lumens. So which I can see some of the reflective material of the HVAC and the umbrella, even with the 15 lumens. And 15 lumens can run for 35 hours. So it can run Damn. for 35 hours at this. Damn. Which, I mean... Stick it on the freaking vent. A thousand percent enough to do to do any pop it right there. I mean, honestly, like thirty five hours of being able to work at this cool table too. like that. Get oh, the, indicator light. Yeah. Nice. Can, you can see it. So the lowest setting when it's in its cycle is infinity low, which is fifteen lumens. To go into that moonlight point five mode, you gotta press and hold. So we were never in that, well, at 
till the end. We weren't in that in that firefly mode. I like the gradual. It's not steps. It what did not get hot. That was my next thing. Obviously, we're Olay fanboys. I love the Olay. This did not get hot at all. Or I mean, yeah, we'll do the... it got hot, but not as hot as the Olay's did. <clears throat> That's a big deal to me. Still nothing. It's hot. It's barely lukewarm. Like that's no. Like, you get a little little kicker in there. No more than a no. hot plate. You know, I guess hot plate. Jesus Christ! Like, hot plate like, blows water. No, no, like a hot plate. Not a hot plate. <laughs> oh, okay. I said it too quickly. <laughs> <laughs> you see him walking up and just like, touching the hot, hot plate. plate. <laughs> so yeah. So I mean, I, it's got the one up on Olight with that. See, I'm going to be honest. I kind of thought gas station light for a second when I looked at it. I did that not. That never crossed my mind. Really? Nope. I, there was a moment. There was a moment where I was like, I never don't know. It, what, the look of it. But then, I I don't know. It kind of just kept proving itself through and through. Yeah, and like, guys, like, we all know 1,500 lumens is and like overkill unless you're like you looking for uh someone that's lost at sea. Also the gradual climb and decrease. Big big difference. Huge little bonus in there. Heat heat big difference. It's hard to give something like this a stamp because we haven't really tested it, tested it. Like, yeah, but we've given the stamp to other lights that are pretty fantastic. I think <sighs> this one this one as of right now is getting the stamp. And again, I feel like you are fanboying a little bit over Olay. I am, but but it doesn't have the Olay backing, so I think that's why I'm hesitant. See, I feel like this is probably one of those things where we don't realize how big of a deal Through Night is. Yeah. They, they might have a bigger following than we expect. Yeah. I'm saying, I'm saying the stamp for right now. If I backtrack it, we will give an update that I'm backtracking this, you know? But, yeah. I mean, right now, I'm just thoroughly impressed by that size... This, for this size, has been the highest I've seen so far in terms of lumens for that specific size. We're not counting the Rovivons. I don't remember, to be honest with you. No, this 100%. The Sky Ben was bought for a specific purpose. But that was the highest lumen. That's not meant to be my pocket flashlight. This could be my pocket flashlight and have the same lumens as that. That's pretty impressive. That's really impressive. As far as battery capacity, you got anything, this guy know. in your pocket with the warrior in your bag. Like you got two badass flashlights. Yeah. I'm going to say stamp for right now. Yeah. And I agree. I'm, and I'm just going to leave it off at I'm feeling really good about it. Does it get like a potential stamp or like you mean stamp for no, now? No, no, we're gonna give it the stamp because we've done it before. We've given yeah. the stamp being overzealous, but we will let you know in our post yearly review of all the flashes. There's no reason it shouldn't get the stamp. That's that's really what we're getting at here. I mean, other than that, guys, like, subscribe, follow us on Instagram, hit the bell, hit the bell. Other than that, New Age Tactical over and out.